But I agree, seven killing, seven killing the character, the character is a little more, little more sensitive. It's a little more sensitive, a little more like a want to fight with other people <laughs> more because they they are more stressful actually they are more stressful by the environment they are more stress they feel more stressful by the people around more than like this relationship with the direct official yeah, direct official is kind of they try to obey the rule for benefit for example if you have to uh, wash the dishes uh, in, in just a simple example if you want to wash the dishes the daily master is Dean Fire, and if somebody has the rainwater as a direct official, they try to wash the dishes because when they wash dishes, their wife will give a prize, something like that. <laughs> like simply, simply just compliments. And if if somebody has the indirect official as a seven killing star, they try to wash dishes, maybe because they don't want to create a trouble with their wife. So a little different nuance, little different meaning. With, with this rainwater, they wash dishes, they clean the house, and then their wife will give them some kind of compliments and, and price. But with the seven killing star, their mindset is, is kind of OCD. Like they do that because they don't want to get blamed by someone. So those little, little different mindset, is the difference between those direct and indirect. Maybe you already explained about in water, what if weak gray water and mid earth in and yang, also gray water with yang earth become fire. Uh, I did not explain that today. For example, so for gray water, for in, in daily master, we talk about the combination aspect with the official spirit. So this gray water you know, combining with those wu earth and create a fire energy. And that's more direct official for the gray water. And G Earth is indirect, so called seven killing. But this one also for the weak daily master, weak water might already have strong fire or earth in the chart, right? So those combination with direct, well, direct official and the creation of this fire energy could be negative for weak water daily master. Maybe it is better, better to combine with the indirect official as, as a G Earth because they don't create the fire energy. It's just a simple example. This is a wealth spirit, which means if they, weak daily master, weak water daily master, when they meet the Wu earth as a romantic relationship, it creates the fire energy wealth and the direction of five element, the generation cycle of five element is like that. Fire is trying to generate the earth, right? So this combination is only good for, only good for this Wu earth, not good for gray water. So this Wu Earth wants to combine with this Gray Water because this relationship will give some benefit for the Wu Earth. For the Wu Earth, the fire is a mother spirit, right? For Gray Water, fire is wealth spirit. So it, this interpretation can be also possible if the Gray Water meets the Wu Earth, the Gray Water female can get the wealth from the Wu Earth. So this relation, I observed a little bit this situation, the Gray Water how gray water people meets the romantic relationship and then gain some uh, financial benefit. This could be also possible or use their money can be also possible, especially with daily master. So it's not always good, direct official. Playing with this kind of interpretation is very funny. <laughs> it's very fun, actually. I just don't like the term seven killing. Yeah, but direct and indirect. I just want to focus more on this letter itself. The Wu Earth, Wu Earth is like a dry earth. It's like a mountain. And G Earth is more about soil, damp, wet Earth. So if this gray water has strong fire or Earth, the dry Earth, like big mountain energy, is kind of not really preferable. Could be not really preferable. But this soil, damp, wet Earth could be preferable for the weak water daily master. But it's all different if we combine with, this is strong fire with the Earth, not really preferable. This is in Earth, but with the way Earth goat, which can add the heat a little bit more to the strong fire. So either, either it is young earth, either it is in earth, those are both not really good, not really good relation for the weak water daily master. But let's have another example. See, if this kind of young earth or in earth, this earth has 
the monkey or rooster as a mother spirit for the gray water. So these two can be both really preferable relationship for the gray water. So this, this kind of relationship is more important. Only the heavenly stem is the object, but what the heavenly stem has in, on the earthly branch can really influence in a more critical way. The young earth with dog can be really not preferable for strong fire, uh, weak water daily master. This in earth with water could be really preferable, really preferable. Again, this one as well could be really preferable. This one, uh, maybe half and half, but it contains a little bit of, of water inside, a little bit preferable. With this fire in earth, either in earth with the fire, it is not really preferable, right? So we have to really look at the earthy branch actually, more than more than the heavenly stem. And more important thing is it is more yang energy as wood fire yang or metal water in more than yang stem or in stem. This plus and minus is less important than the five elemental energy. These two can be in the middle. But if you have a lot of fire, this could be not really preferable because this wood can create more fire. But you have lack of fire, this could be preferable. <laughs> so it is, it is all depending on your chart. What I want to say is only direct wealth or indirect wealth, direct official, indirect official cannot really determine positive or negative. It doesn't determine preferable or not preferable. It only means kind of the form of the relationship. Like, do I like more government people style? Or do I like more like a scholar style? It is more kind of direct aspect. But indirect is, do I like more fun people or do I like more pleasurable people like who can who can do something sometimes they can d ignore the rules like indirect is opposite from the scholar aspect actually so it is all about preference of each individual actually sometimes indirect people can be really really fun <laughs> really fun direct people direct people can be really boring actually boring but stable boring but stable versus fun, but a little bit unstable. <laughs> so, but in ancient time, in ancient time, having a like government job or having a stable title as a, like I'm a prime minister or I'm a teacher in school, those kind of people were more preferred, were preferred in ancient time. Like in ancient time, like the people like idols in, in this year, these, these days, like BTS or whatever, the girl group or boy groups, those people in ancient time, people's eyes, they are like a crown, clown or crown, clown, clown, clown. Yeah, they, they are just like a performer, like entertainers. So they were not really preferable husband or, or wife image in ancient time. Because of that, the classics say, Oh, direct is more is more preferred. Direct people, direct official is better, or direct wealth is better. They said they 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 more care about stable job with the what they determine the right person. <laughs> yeah, sorry, Christian. It was like um, yesterday's decision. Yeah, today like many questions are about direct or indirect. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, you just come in. I I have to. <laughs> end uh, today's live session in a couple minutes watch the video when i whenever i upload sorry for late notice sunday live i try to um have a live session this week for the european and singapore people and next week i might not be able to have the live session if i can if i can i will i will do on sunday night as well today that was all we mostly talk about the heavenly stem combination and we cover the earth and metal and water daily master in this goat month in July. We talk a little bit about the ghost gate. The animal spirits are in TCM. Oh, this one, the goat and tiger. Yeah, we, we cover a little bit about that. Focusing on animal is all just symbolic. So yeah, we'll cover. It is great when it's that early. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. We, not, not in TCM. They don't teach in TCM. Yeah, TCM is created by modern Chinese country, so they ignore all all the deep meaning about the earthy branches or animals. They only care about the time. Time like like goat time is between one p.m. to three p.m. and then it 
corresponds with the small intestine and that's it I think and if we learn more about that as a classical way so there is another way of the Chinese medicine called it CCM not TCM TCM is traditional Chinese medicine and the CCM is classical Chinese medicine and my school in Portland Oregon is they teach the classical way so they they talk a lot of the earthly branches but those are not enough <laughs> actually yeah there are much more meaning but it is all about the yang energy or yin energy inside yeah. if we learn the animals we can learn more about the each organ so okay thank you everyone if somebody is interested in the oriental medicine with the batsa the is medical batsa membership yeah try to look at the membership videos thank you so much I'll see you guys in maybe a couple of weeks or if possible next week. Okay? Bye bye.